What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel. Just a quick, short and sweet video today. We're going to be giving you a bit of a weekly roundup. This is in relation to content and a bit of news. We have a couple of other videos out. So kicking off, we did have a little bit of, of a mess with the Fortress players, the new Showtime players, right? So just to kind of talk about that, they did release these Fortress players, obviously early this morning uh, when the maintenance first ended. So it was like 8 a.m. in the morning. And these were the players here. So you had Thiago Silva, Militao and Van Dijk as the new Showtime players. So obviously these followed on from Haaland and Kane and Oshman last week. Um, but the three of these obviously were there and then they weren't there. So people were able to spin obviously. And there was an issue with the um, wording of the player skill description, right? So it says that they will be back uh, on the 10th of March. Depending on when I upload this video, they'll already probably be back after the maintenance tonight. So, um, yeah, after the maintenance on Wednesday. So it just said that there was a there was a, a kind of, if people are going on looking and they can't spin these, that is why. We also got news on V2.5, the first details on that. I have a full video out on that, so I'm not going to spend too much time on that. And then on to other stuff, right? So as we do every week, um, we take a look at new stuff. No, nothing in authentic match apart from the trial match that's still there. Events as usual. It's the rinse and repeat events here. We've got the chance deal, your free chance deal there um, with the worldwide clubs. That is obviously the tour event that you're going to be playing. And again, you get your worldwide club after three thousand points. That's against the AI. You can sim that. European clubs, that's against the AI as well. That is from the other day. Then we also have the national team one. That's still ongoing. You get your trainer points as rewards for that one. That is against the AIs. The three of those against the AI. And this one is still ongoing. That's kind of part of a career objective or a career event. We also have the worldwide clubs here. It's the same as this one, except that it's obviously online. And then you've got these two ones still ongoing as well. You've got six days left to do that. And the worldwide club user matches are your 50 eFootball coins as a reward. As usual with that one, eFootball League has been reset as well. Let's see where I am. I'm probably going to be in like Division... S oh man, Division 7. Division 7. So that has been reset and that will run until April the 6th. So we've got another month, just under a month to go with that one for the divisions. I'm going to be hitting that fairly hard. We also have new players that are still available uh, on the shop, as from you can see here from the banner. So we've got the Worldwide Player Event. Uh, or the Worldwide Player of the Weeks. Um, I've already done a review on that as well. So Delict, I would say Salah, even though I don't really, you know, get on with Salah or play well with him. I'd say Delict and Diaby are definite players uh, that could be absolute game changing. If you haven't got a beastly squad already, these guys look insane. I've done a full review on all of that Player of the Week. And then, of course, we also have the uh, Fortress ones, which will be added tomorrow. They'll be back tomorrow. The IX ones are still there. The eFootball Championship Round 2 club selection. These guys are still going to be here. Or sorry, Round 1. These guys are still going to be here. Uh, we've already done reviews on that. If you've missed that, you can check it out. Um, there's some good players in that as well. But yeah, I mean, everything else is kind of the same. You've all, these these are going to be staying on for another 62 days. Um, and that's pretty much it, man. I mean, I think the biggest thing is the announcement of the new V2.5 um, stuff in there. You can check that out. And all of this stuff is still pretty much the same. The match pass, of course, will end next Thursday. And then you can get the new match pass. Um, but yeah, that's it for me, lads. I will be back quite soon. Don't forget to get this 3,000 eFootball points as well. You can redeem that. I have videos up and everything. But yeah, short and sweet, to the point. That is all the details there. And don't forget to get all your login bonuses and all that sort of stuff as well. If you uh, have played any of that, there's some stuff in there as well. So yeah, I will be back quite soon with another video just to keep you guys up to date if you're not at your consoles. That is a content roundup for this week. And I'll talk to you in a bit.